It's spring. The weather is warm, the sun is shining, and those pesky weeds are taking over the garden again. You yank and tear every last trace of stem and leaf. Ah, there. You can't see them anymore. But does that fix the problem? Nope. They keep coming back again, and again, and again. Pulling off the stem and leaves addresses the symptoms but keeps the root, the real underlying cause, still intact. This familiar cycle probably occurs in more than just your garden. Weeds are like problems in life that keep reoccurring. By identifying the root cause, you can come up with ways to prevent these problems from happening. There are several different tools for identifying a root cause as part of a root cause analysis, like process mapping, focus interviews, and cause and effect diagrams. But one of the simplest tools is the five whys. Begin by identifying a specific problem and ask why it occurs. Each why should build on the previous response. Now there's nothing magical about the number five. Sometimes a root cause may be reached after asking why just a few times. Other times, deeper questioning is needed. Continue this process of questioning until you have uncovered the root cause of the problem and can form a clear strategy to eradicate it once and for all. Root cause identification as part of a root cause analysis using the five whys. Get to the root of your problems.